Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Now today it's going to be a short and sweet one where we're just going to be looking at one species in particular, going through some facts about them, and just letting you know a bit more about UK wildlife. And today it's going to be the red fox. But before we go any further, why not leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel to learn more about the world's wildlife and, well, with this series, the UK's wildlife more specifically. Famed for their cunning and stealth, these orangey coloured dogs with bushy tails can be seen all over the UK in rural and urban areas. They're well adaptable, which has allowed them to invade our cities as well as being able to survive in many different habitats, which has also led to them being one of the most widely spread carnivorous mammals in the world, with a massive geographical range going all the way from America across the Northern Hemisphere and can even be found in the Southern Hemisphere in areas such as Australia. Red foxes are not fussy eaters, and will happily munch on a wide range of stuff including small mammals, birds, frogs and insects, as well as berries and other fruits. Those that live in our towns and cities can even be found rummaging through bins to scavenge any leftovers. Red foxes are about as big as a medium sized dog, measuring on average about 62 to 72 centimetres and weighing around 5 to 7 kilograms. It may be surprising to know that even though they're a member of the dog family, they have a relatively short lifespan of only around two to three years. Red foxes live in a burrow system, which is called an earth. They'll scent mark their territorial borders with urine, which will create a strong, recognisable odour and allow other foxes to know whether they're entering another's territory or leaving their own. As well as marking out their territorial borders, they also use scent glands on their feet to mark well-used trails so they can navigate and follow them easily at night. Red foxes are social animals and live in loose family groups. They are normally made up of a breeding male, breeding female and their young. Mating takes place in the winter and this is when foxes are most vocal, with males making a barking noise while females, also known as vixens, make a spine chilling screaming sound. By spring, the female will give birth to a litter of cubs in an underground den. Normally four to five cubs will be born and they will be cared for by both the male and the female and by the autumn, those cubs are fully self-sufficient and some will leave to establish their own territories while others may remain with the family group, sometimes even helping their parents to raise the following years young. Red foxes are extremely easy to identify with their fur coat having an orangey red above, white below and black tips to their ears, dark brown feet and a white tip to their bushy tail. They're mainly nocturnal, so for your best chance of seeing one, head out in the evening and if you're lucky, you might even be able to spot one wandering around in the day. 